At Marco, we have four main types of invoices. This video is an overview of contract invoices. However, if you receive multiple types of invoices from us, you may want to watch the other videos in this series. Depending on your company, you may see some blank spaces on our invoices. For example, some clients provide us with PO numbers if they're helpful for their billing system. If your organization doesn't use them, you won't see those boxes filled in. You also may see what looks like repeated address information. While the billing address and the client's location are often the same, some of our clients have multiple locations or their contracts are billed to a parent company. In the middle section of this invoice, you'll see information about your account number, contract number, payment terms, a due date, and the balance due. You'll also see contact information, the amount of the contract, and the contract start and end date. Depending on your contract, you may be billed annually, quarterly, or monthly. We also have some clients that prefer a one-time payment that will last for the duration of their contract. Under Remarks, you'll see what is included in your contract and the base rate for these services. These remarks should match the information that is outlined in an approved quote. In this sample invoice, you'll see that this managed IT contract is based upon 300 users. You'll also see that this contract is billed monthly. This invoice is for September 5th through October 4th, 2022. Below, you'll see any equipment that's included in this contract. For managed IT, we don't use serial numbers for equipment. However, this number indicates what it's being used for and is for our reference only. This invoice subtotal is $33,314.44. Add $19.75 tax and you get $33,334.19 as the invoice total. Since this balance hasn't yet been paid, the balance due is the same. It's important to note that we do add a 3% surcharge on payments made by credit card. That's because credit card companies charge us a fee for processing the payment. If you'd like less paperwork, going paperless is always an option. And if you ever need to change your contact information or you have questions about your bill, contact our accounts receivable team. Just one bit of housekeeping before you go. The example we used in the video isn't a real invoice. We always take great care to safeguard our clients' privacy and data. No matter what we're doing for our clients, including making this video, security is always top of mind. Stay safe, and thanks for watching.